Cocktail Amy Man parody. If you take any of this seriously, consider yourself one of the biggest idiots in the world. Well, okay, yeah, I do find these women attractive, but that's far from the point. So anyway, hello, people. I'm Frost95 here, and um, since it's almost a year now uh, until the next Valentine's Day, I thought I would count down the top five non-furry female characters I find attractive. The furry and the male characters may come at a later date. Uh, so let's get this started. Uh, number five. This one... I, I know people are going to freak out over me for picking this one at number five. And I guess technically you would say that, that this one's technically male, but I'm going to put it down as female anyway. It's female Naruto. You know, when he uses that harem jutsu. Now, the reason for number five is that you don't really see much of them. I mean, yeah, there's you could always look up hentai for it, but that's it. It, it It's not that revealing. It, it, how, how am I supposed to get turned on by that? You know, but at the same time, it's... Oh, um, anyway. Uh, number four. Leaf from Pokemon. Now, number four and number three are both from Pokemon because... Although I was initially trying to keep this out one per franchise, I couldn't pick between these two. Uh, so, at number four is Leaf. I could just imagine her right now. Naked. Oh. Um, but, uh, uh, nah, I'm not that turned on, though. Um, <laughs> oh. Anyway, um, number three. May. Oh, bomb. Oh, God. Oh. Uh, May, I think, has the nicest pair of legs. By far in the Pokemon franchise. I mean, Misty, I'm sorry, but eat your heart out. And I know I'm going to get uh, a lot of hate comments uh, for not including May or Misty, but I just find these two more attractive. Oof. Number two, Har. I, I don't know how you're really supposed to pronounce this, um, but uh, the melatonin of Haru is one of the. Animes I have currently been watching. I've been watching for a while, and uh, I have to say she is. Oh, I'm getting excited now. Um, <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, her no nonsense attitude really makes you want her more because, you know, you really want her. It really makes you want to let her, her down a bit more. So what could beat this girl at attractiveness? Well, believe it or not, I found a girl that's even more attractive. And it's number one. Now, this girl has everything that I absolutely find attractive in a woman. She wears tight leather. She's sassy. She has an absolute gorgeous butt. It's Black Cat from Spider-Man. Oh, God. Wow. Wow. That is just drop dead gorgeous right there. Oh god! Especially if you see her getting knocked out via knockout gas or something, and it's just it, it it's it. She just turns me on so much. Quillfish, please cut, please cut the uh, recording, please. Uh, that oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, black cat, yes! What? We're recording? Still? So they, they're they hearing me faster? B b bit. <laughs> oh, well, uh, it's our first 95. Oh, yeah. I'm signing off. Oh, yeah, black cat. Oh, yeah. Bat that for me, black cat. In case you missed it at the start, take this out. Well, Take any of this seriously, and you're an idiot. And for anybody who's wondering, yes, I do tend to find these girls attractive. And 
yes, masturbate too. Got a problem with that? Seriously, I've, I, I can electrocute you because I'm an Afros. No problem? No. Okay. This is Afros95 signing out properly. Peace out, YouTubers.